better be watching. Fire! <laughs> Holy sh What's up guys? Welcome back to another Kaiju episode. Episode 6. We're, we're officially halfway there, given that it's only 12 episodes. Um, the title is... <laughs> Fuck me, dude. That's not the title, but it's just like the words, you know, trying to pronounce them. Saga, <laughs> Saga mi hara, <laughs> Saga mi harara. My R's are horrible, always have been. So uh, I had speech class in like elementary school. Never helped like how to talk like a normal, normal human being. Saga mi harara. Neutralization operation at daybreak. I could say all those easily, but Saga Mary, <laughs> I stumble. I trip off of that shit. Trip over that. Saga Sa Saga Mi Harara. Harara. Saga Mi Harara. Neutralization operation at daybreak. That's a long title for episode. And there's there's been longer. So last episode, Kafka. Went beast. Wait, no, that was two episodes ago. What the fuck happened? Oh, yeah. It's been a week. Last episode, it was just a lot of bonding, a lot of friendship building, and then the alarms went off at the end of the episode, setting us up for a cliffhanger of what to expect in this episode. So, hopefully, this one is going to have some. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm good all about plot building, writing, slow pace, all of that, but. I do love action, so I'm okay with it though. I just, I'm always like, yeah, if there's action, I'm okay with it. But then there, at that time, there's horrible writing and lots of action. Um, uh, shit, what's his name? Oh my god, I'm look, I'm picturing him right now. Uh, he made the Justice League movies. Uh, Zack Snyder. Zack Snyder, great for the visuals. But when it comes to writing, Meh. I, and I'm not a Zack Snyder hater. I still really like him a lot. Um, but And I like his movies. But the writing of it is just shit. So then that just really lowers the quality of like his movies. But The Watchmen, 300, really good. I like Sucker Punch. I, I mean, I like all of his movies because they have such crazy good visuals and action. But then he's the, he's the type that just sucks with the writing plot concept to where it's just like... It's a B minus C plus type of movie by the end of it. But enough about that. So yeah, we're gonna continue. Kafka. <laughs> oh my god. I need I need more coffee. So yeah, we're gonna continue um kaiju number eight, episode six. And no theories for this one. You know, I, I keep feeling like I'm jumping the gun on predictions and everything. So I'm just going to assume by the end of this season, Kafka is going to go kaiju mode in front of his squad mates. And then it's going to probably end on a cliffhanger. So like we won't see how they react to it or how they treat them till season two. Uh, that's kind of like the only theory I have. So we're going to continue. It's 3 a.m. Damn. Okonogi, give us a sit rep. Why Saga Mihara of all places? Isn't the defense force here yet? I really gotta use the bathroom, Mom. <laughs> I really gotta shit, Mom. Like, this is very inconvenient. I'm about to blow my pants. <laughs> We've got JSDF support. You think about it, like, with all this tech and everything. They have some relevant, like, some relevant good tech. I would think that they would have some type of better evacuation methods than, like, Greyhound buses that just pile up to load people on to drive away. Like, you feel like they'd have, like, some some aircraft transportation for everyone. I don't know. They could be limited on resources. Who knows? Yes, ma'am. They're setting up an artillery command post at the Leon Mall parking lot now. We believe it's resurfacing now because Whoa. it's beginning its reproduction. Phase. A mushroom? The Kaiju? Hoju's reemergence was accompanied by the appearance a of fungus? large numbers of Yoju. Our best option is the middle of Sector Bravo. Is there going to be a lot of them? That's where I'll be taking the shot on the Honju. We'll log this mission as the Sagamihara neutralization operation. She said the word I couldn't say. We'll log this mission as the Sagamihara neutralization. Sagamihara. That's so much easier now. You hear someone say it and it's easy. Sagamihara. Hara, hara. Let's we'll, we'll do one more. Listen. All Route 16. We'll log this mission as the Sagamihara neutralization. Sagamihara. 
How could I not say that before? I feel like I'm a totally different person now. <laughs> Station operation. And best of luck. Best of luck, fuckers. Everyone ready to go hunt some kaiju? <laughs> It's their first Our one, first man. Mission. Yeah. Don't you dare disappoint me out there. Kafka Hibino. He said your ass. Shut up. <laughs> uh, oh my god, bro. Oh, Vice Captain! I think he's about to puke! Pukes on everyone. <laughs> Please let me live. Is that mushroom moving around? And that is the home you we're here to take out. That's crazy. That's crazy looking. Oh, it definitely is mushroom kaiju. It's releasing like the mushroom Here's powder brief. gas. Constant stream of yoju spawning from it. Damn. We set up the neutralization zone in an area with no major infrastructure. How much it'll cost to fix? and how long mm, fixing it'll take. That's cool. Naturally, those platoons deploying with rookies in tow will be at the rear. Real life in experience. Words, OST solid. It's good yeah. every episode. Go ahead and put your training scores out of your mind. They won't save a single life in the field. Hell yeah. Let's freaking go! <laughs> yeah! Oh my god. Yeah! Don't forget to have fun, kids. Don't forget to have fun. You keep improving at this rate, you're getting tossed. You got three <laughs> months to shape up. I don't think I've ever felt this kind of pressure before. I do think, though, it's going to probably turn it like... Because so far, he's been one-punching these enemies. He's the one punch of the Attack on Titan Kaiju-verse. I have seen memes where it's like, this is a combination of One Punch Man, My Hero Academia, and Attack on Titan with kaijus i'm okay with it because they're all great series i like them all a lot which i do need to catch up on my hero season six still i haven't watched it i'm fucking behind but i i bet you he's probably gonna one punch the big kaiju as well i feel it's gonna be one of those moments where like he's constantly one punching and then there's gonna be that one he has to 20 punch or something and yet for some reason I am absolutely pumped right now. I'm so fucking pumped, bro. Of course you are. Oh, uh, that's so cool. All right. <laughs> Time to rock my first mission. Charge! Rock my first mission. He's just... <laughs> no, man. Bro, he cracks me up. Mrs. Badass. Artillery team, please commence fire support. Drive the Honju towards Sector Bravo. So is she just a sharpshooter? Because so far that's all they've been doing with her, I think, is just dropping her from helicopters and she's blown people to bits with a cannon, which is not a bad thing. I just feel like she'd be more, like, in the combat than what she has been. Like, she, because she's, like, just a hardcore sniper, really, like a cannon sniper. Roger that. JSDF Artillery Regiment Command Post. Now commencing fire support for Defense Force. just scratching its back really it's like thanks bub your superiors are all watching let's see you blow them away <laughs> it's at, begun at least one person has to die i don't want anyone to die but one person has to die maybe not this episode maybe the next one but someone's got to die soon but it's not like it was during the exam and the suit is actually helping me this time oh wow i can feel it Holy Unleashing shit! Combat power. Two percent. <laughs> oh my god! Don't charge ahead. You and your one percent can stay at the back of the formation. Jesus, Come dude. Up, man, nothing from the front line. Understood. I'll hang back and aim for anything that looks like it might be a weak point. I love her theme music too. It's so good. You hear my squeaky chair? It's ridiculous. It's getting worse and worse. I am getting my new chair today. I ordered it a couple days ago, so the squeaky bitch is gonna be out. All right, her theme music, really good. Point. Damn, put him in his place. 
That's not the kind of firepower you get out of a rookie. So this is what Kikoru Shinomiya can do. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh my God. Vitals at normal. Your heart rate is increasing rapidly. You She's... didn't need to tell me that, you stupid suit. She's crushing on him. All right, two legs down. Finish it. Thinking about it. It's like, Alex, quit fucking pausing. But I was just thinking about this, because Pacific Rim's phenomenal. It had amazing CGI. It's totally capable of having a live action of this. Like, they could totally pull off a Kaiju number no. 8 live action. Because for the most part, they already did with Pacific Rim. For the visuals, everything. Similar world concepts. All you gotta do is make a, a CGI humanoid Kaiju. Fighting other Kaijus, basically. And then everything else is you got down to a T. So I think they could really pull off a Kaiju number eight live action without fucking it up. But most likely they'd probably fuck it up. Excellent work, Furiyoshi. Yeah, you see that, <laughs> Reno? Oh my God. Wait, hold up. Did you just freaking solo that thing? <laughs> you solo yeah. that thing? I swapped out my burst rounds. I figured I'd give freeze rounds a try. Oh. I think I like them better. Every shot I hit slows the enemy down a bit. That's fucking cool. Once I get used to these, it should make me even better at hunting kaiju. There's different bullet types. But still, burst I have types. to keep getting stronger. That's fucking sick. Smart. When the hell did they start building rookies like this? <laughs> when did they start building rookies like this? Oh my god, that's so funny. You guys are just getting soft. Two liter Nakinoshima? What's going on with these newbies? But I wasn't ready. Fucking badasses, man. Probably six confirmed kills now. So what have you been doing over there, Haruichi? Oh, me? I was putting in most of the work on four of those six. But you knew that. <laughs> oh, Mama's eating good this year. Oh you my just god. Vice Captain Hoshi Mama's eating good there this year. Real standouts in the group. But it Throw me in there, that. shit. There's got to be some way I can help, right? Wait. That's the thing, man. I think, like, him in his human form will probably always be a hindrance or just never good enough. So I think, and story-wise, don't confirm or deny. You know, don't be that guy, uh, given that I don't know anything. Um, I think going forward, whenever he reveals he is a kaiju, which I feel it's going to have to be, like, they know he's a kaiju, and then they're going to, like, use him as, like, a great asset. And then that's when he'll be his full potential of like what he admires to be or strives to be as like an asset to helping everyone in society with his powers. Didn't he say? Listen up! We don't have any info on these things' weak points yet. <clears throat> oh, he's gonna inspect I've got it. My own weapons. Time to start using them. Huh? Oh. What the hell is he doing? The suit makes dismantling the bodies a piece of cake, even at 1% power. That's cool. Well, Go. for the most part, this Going looks like in. any other fungal-type kaiju. So where is it? The bottom? Could be over here, maybe. It's butthole? Wait a sec. It's butthole. It's Captain Hoshina. Definitely I've the butthole. I've located the Yoju's core. What? It's at the base of the neck, but it's covered in these hardened muscle fibers that function as the Yoju's spine. There's one more thing, sir, and it's a big one. It's the Yoju have their own reproductive organs. We might see a whole nother wave of Yoju spawning out of their corpses. Oh. Kafka. Fucking genius. You done good, bud. You done good, kid. Okonogi. But clearly your study sessions paid off. Damn fine work. Nice. Anything I can do to contribute to the mission, no matter how small. What a guy. Is... Something's gonna happen, Is yeah. The heck? Looks like they're getting started. Sweep the leg. She looks fucking cool, though. Is that like a VR system? Is she, is she playing a game at a time like this? What's she doing? Is she playing Beat Saber? <laughs> She's probably playing Shoot Saber with her gun. Dude. Target acquired. Roger. All conditions met. I don't know if it's you gonna do anything. To Take a look. This is where I'm at. Oh shit. I feel like this is a bigger gun than before. Oh my god. 
unleashed combat power. This is fucking sick. Ninety-six percent. You better be watching. Fire! <laughs> Holy shit! See that? Oh my god. That was the woman you're looking to stand beside. Second round, ready to fire. Roger, you are cleared to fire. Dude. Holy shit. It's collapsing. Oh, that's so cool. That was fucking epic. Definitely gonna be using that image as my thumbnail. <laughs> like, she's so fucking cool, dude. Third round loaded, ready to fire. Uh, Roger. Cleared to fire. Something. Might happen. Hanju has taken critical damage! Captain, you're I don't something know. else. I don't know. Fourth round, ready to fire. Uh -huh. Wait, why? Captain, the Honju's vitals are gone, and it's not even twitching. Give the order. Um, fire. Damn. <laughs> um, fire. Damn. Seeing it on TV or even through binoculars just isn't the same. Is she trying to show she off in front really of him? She on a whole different level. So, you ready to give it up yet? Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you want to stand by her side, you got to be able to match that level of strength. Should I take that to mean you're capable of putting out that kind of power yourself, Vice Captain? <laughs> Not a chance. Not a chance! Now, as far as handling small to mid-sized threats... Oh shit, he's about to be a badass. With his knives? Oh my god! I'd say I've got the edge on her. The pun! He's got the edge on him. Are those swords? The fucking anime click, like... They're dead. They're dead. It's like... I don't have a fucking pen next to anything, but it's like... Dead. That's all they do. And they just... So fuck... It's... But regardless... It's cool every time. Like, 100% of the time, it's cool every time. I never even saw him pull them out. Going all the way back to the Muramachi period. That's so Swordsmanship fucking sick. Swordsmanship is a family tradition. Oh, wow. I love That's the color. Like the glows and shit. To suit our individual strengths. She's still going to town on it. The Honju's down. The real problem yeah. is the swarms of Yoju inside its body. They could rebuild it, maybe? Just as I thought. Heading our way. One punch them, Kafka. I don't know, there's so many. I feel like it's just crawl on top of each other and like build one big one again. I don't know. It's like a spider, though. Okay, good job, team. Lean like, up you kill a pregnant spider and like it has a lot of eggs in it, they're all coming out. It's disgusting. I'm Let's make it quick. This will be a whole new mission. <laughs> <laughs> the rookies don't want to fight anymore. You're welcome to kick back and let the veterans take care of the rest. Mm. You know, if you want. Oh. Oh. We're headed back out there, ma'am. <coughs> They'll reach a whole new level. Something's got to happen for Most Kafka to step in. Defense Force combat power tops out around 20 to 30 percent. Let's get back to the front. Right. Hmm, Some, something's gonna happen. This isn't good. I'm not liking the vibes. Monster sweeper? No, no! No, it's the fucking end of the episode too. Cliffhanger. Fuck, it's the bad kaiju dude. Why would they have someone out here? No. They're gonna get injured, probably not killed. Ichikawa is not gonna get killed. Crossing my fingers don't say anything but the other dude might be killed or severely injured i think ichikawa was going to be injured too but not killed god hey, damn didn't you hear the alarm your crew needs to stay clear till the fighting is Ooh. over <sighs> so they got this one too i loaded them with reproductive organs but they've been destroyed he's playing How a game they even know where to look with them all maybe someone on the force is more knowledgeable than i thought you two know anybody like that? Nobody got you the way I do. Stupid son of a bitch. No after credits. Ah, motherfucker. Motherfucker. 
So it sounds like he's playing a game. Like, like all these kaiju that he's sending to like attack and do shit seems like they're from him. And it's like he's trying to take over, wipe out the human population, something. But it's, it definitely seems like a chess match now because he's making moves trying to destroy shit, but then Kafka's figuring out the weaknesses and everything on them and taking them down. So it's just back and forth, back and forth, which is really cool. And he's like, he's an actual kaiju who could transform into a human. Kai, Kafka is a human who could transform into a kaiju. So there are two theories, or they might go together into one. By the end of this season, Kafka is going to reveal his kaiju abilities to everyone because he's going to have to save everyone from this guy. Like, yeah, I think it's like an all in one theory. Like, this guy's going to be a main threat, and. Kaiju, uh, Kafka's gonna have to try and save everyone, and to do that, he has to turn into his kaiju abilities. Uh, because it's gonna be one of those moments where he's like, it's either I stay on like the defense force and blah blah, and like have a risk of people dying, or I could turn into my kaiju abilities now to protect people, knowing that they're probably gonna try and hunt me down after this and try and kill me. Or, and kick like I'll be from like kicked off of the defense force and everything. So I think it's like that that sacrifice thing, or it's just like I'm gonna do it just to save everyone anyways. I don't care if I'm on the squad or not, or if they try and hunt me down or kill me after. I'm gonna try and protect them. So I think it's gonna be something like that. He's gonna fight this kaiju dude. He, they might think he kills him, but he gets away or l survives somehow, and then it might reveal another bigger bad. I don't know. But there's definitely a lot too. I like this though, because it makes me think and question a lot. It's not like a plain, simple plot. I love like, there's just so much mystery aspect to it. So it's very good. It's very good. I like it. This was a good episode. I don't know how next one's gonna, I think next one's gonna, because this one was definitely too easy. I call it like, they, they killed that giant kaiju. And then I'm like, there's more to it. Like it's either gonna come back to life or something else is gonna happen. So as we saw, the something else is happening. So I think that's gonna go on most of next episode. And then that one's gonna have like a soft conclusion, which that would be episode seven. And then we would have five left. I don't know, a lot's happening in a good way already, but also still not revealing a lot. Still a lot of good questions, unknown shit. Um, but yeah, that's about it for this one. I really like it a lot. This is good, this is good. My chair's squeaking a shitload. My new one should be here in like 30 minutes. So I'll see you guys later. Bye.